Hey, what's up YouTube? So today I'm going to show you how to mine Ravencoin. Now, it's going to be a no BS video, so if you like those kind of videos, you know how you can make your content creator happy. Let me show you how you set it up. So the first thing you want to do is, is you want to go to Google, type in T-Rex Miner, and go to their official site, T-Rex-Miner.com. Go there, go to the top, press on Downloads, and download the T-Rex Miner for Windows or Linux, whichever system you use. Now, once you have downloaded it, you should get a folder like this. Extract it to any place you deem fit, and you should get a map like this. Now, you can sort it by name. It's usually at the bottom like this. The RVN are the Raven Miners. Now, each single one of these is linked to a different website. For example, this is linked to twominers.com, this is linked to ravenminer.com, and this is linked to woollypooly.com, or whatever the name is. Now, you can search these websites up on the internet. Let me just show you what, for example, ravenminer looks like. So we have arrived at ravenminer.com, and you have a little overview here. What is your average hash rate? What is your, you know, the amount of raven you have mined, or pending raven, cleared raven? Um, my threshold is set at five Raven, so that's like extremely quick uh, payouts. Uh, you can change this by joining their Discord server. I think it says, yeah, change changeable. I don't see why you should do that. I mean, you get payouts pretty quickly, so I like it. Um, over here you have like an estimate. Now, I just turn on my laptops just so you can see what it looks like. This number should go up over time as your hash rate is increasing because it generally takes some time for your hash rate to build up. Okay, now for the most important part, let me show you how you set these up, where you put in your uh, deposit code, how you can change the name of the system. Let me just show you how you set it up. So we have arrived back at our folder and I'm just gonna show you my Raven Miner because that's personally the website, uh, website I like to use. So right click on it, go to show more options, go to edit and over here, well, you might already see what you have to do. It's very simple. So over here, you can place the uh, server you want to mine from. I'll put them down in the description so you can find them if you're in the US or in Asia or in Europe, which one you should use. This one is for Europe, I'm from Europe. The, um, so this is where you want to, uh, place the the server you want to mine from so for me that's europe if you're from america you want to put it in the us server once again you can find that down in the description okay from this point there is generally a standard raven mine coiner address present um, hoping you're going to mine to them it's it's generally from raven miner itself so you're going to have to change this number until the dot this number to your Raven coin miner deposit address. You can find that on Binance or Coinbase, or I don't know if Coinbase even supports Raven coin. I don't know, but you have to find your deposit code for Raven coin. Place it here, so change it by the one that's already there, and you should mine to the right address. Now, once you have set that up, you can also, like after the dot, you can give the name and just don't touch the rest. Now over here you can see Kapow, this is the algorithm you're mining with. Don't change that. If you feel like feeling like eth hash, that doesn't work. So you're, I'm just gonna be stuck to this one. And that's actually pretty much how you set it up. You can just save the file, press on the little cross, and you can do this for all of these. The only difference is that you will have to visit a different website to feel your to view your stats. Now to view your stats is actually really simple. Let's say we're going to Google and type in Raven Coin Miner. So we're going to Raven Coin Miner. If you want to find your address, just fill in your deposit address here. So I've already set mine up and you will be linked back to the website. Now it's basically the same story for two miners or any other site. You can also do this for Ethereum. The only difference is, is if you search in the list and you want to mine, let's say, Ethereum, you're going to have to change the deposit address to your Ethereum deposit address, etc. Everything you mine here is pretty much set up um, the same way as you set Ravencoin uh, mining up. Now, how much you make 
totally depends on the system you have, um, also on like the amount of GPUs you're going to use to mine. Um, I cannot say how much you make, you just have to turn it on and go to the website and just check the estimate after a good hour of mining. So you get a pretty good idea, actually very accurate idea on how much you're going to make. So that that's totally different um, per system. Now, also a thing with T-Rex that if you're using a, a light hash rate GPU, T-Rex miner kind of bypasses that. So you're not going to get like the full potential, but you're going to get a very efficient way of mining. So that's also a good thing. Now, once again, if you like this video, you know what to do. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you next time. Peace.